Hi, this is Justice with Tablet Pro. This is a really quick video showing you how to purchase the Surface Pro 7 Plus. Um, I'm actually recording with the Surface Pro 7 Plus this video, so this one is a Surface Pro 7. But uh, how do you buy it? It's a business-only purchase, but you don't actually have to be a business to buy it. And so we're going to go through those steps real quickly. Super fast video. Let's go ahead and jump over to the Microsoft site. All right, so I have this link in the description. So Surface Pro 7 Plus for business, click on this link up here. You can adjust, uh, chat now, no thanks, choose your color, configure now, and down here they have a phone number. That's not the one I used. So the one I used is right here, 844-834-8667. Um, I bought through a guy named Jeff, and he was kind enough to give me a 9% discount, which you can ask for. I have no promises, but 9% was great. It ended up being um, like $200 off, just about. And the one I bought was the i7 512 gigabyte version. Now, the Surface Pro 7 Plus, uh, in my opinion, is a huge step forwards versus the Surface Pro 7. Uh, gaming, I'm getting pretty close to double, um, 33%, not 33%, like 66% to 100% um, increase in frame rates. So if I'm 30 frame rates uh, in a game right now, then I'm uh, like 45 to 60 frames per second on the same game, same settings on the Surface Pro 7 Plus over the Surface Pro 7, uh, both i7 models. A big fan. Battery life is definitely, definitely improved and noticeably better. Uh, drawing on the screen is almost exactly the same. The screen's not brighter. Uh, pretty much everything else is the same. I, I do like because the Surface Pro 7 had a lot of problems, like a lot of problems. And I owned nine of them in the process of finding one that didn't have any big major problems. I've only owned one Surface Pro 7 Plus and really it gets a little hot in the upper right corner but um other than that I and mean, it's still still very usable even when it's hot so it's not going to burn off your skin it, it seems like they've ironed out a lot of the kinks from the surface pro 7 and the price and if you want to get the uh what is the let's see 899 is which version let's check i3, i5, don't get the i3, get the i5 at very least, it's a hundred bucks more. Um, I love my version. 32 gigabyte, one terabyte uh, version sounds glorious. Um, I have on the, in the micro SD card slot, I bought a 512 gigabyte micro SD card, um, Lexar or something, I, I'll put the uh, link in the description. I think it was like 70, 80 bucks and, um, you know, difference in size. Like I, I installed all of my steam. I've got like 470 gigs of steam games on there and they run at the same frame rate as the ones that are installed natively on the SSD. That's pretty awesome. I mean, like, it's not an unusable situation trying to, um, you know, like you can only store documents and word documents on the drive. Now you can, you can actually store your steam library. Um, the windows store, the Microsoft app store, uh, theoretically allows you to install also to a micro SD card slot, but I have not had good luck with that. Uh, okay. All right. That's it. Just a real quick guide service pro seven plus, um, two thumbs up at the same time from me. I love this device. And uh, I think it's going to continue to get better in a couple more ways um, soon. If you haven't subscribed, subscribing to this channel is how you promote this channel. This is the best and easiest way to do it. I appreciate that. Uh, again, thank you for watching. Until next time, stay creative and have a wonderful day.